my name is Ty Renee and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So for today's video, this is obviously a requested one. Um, last week on Twitter, I had told you guys like, hey, um, Wednesday, October 25th will be my 23rd birthday and I wanted to celebrate with you guys and I had asked you guys like, did you guys want to do a haul or a Q&A and surprisingly you guys chosen the haul. So, I've bought a lot of stuff um, within like the past month. Usually when I buy stuff for myself on my birthday, I like to do it like mid, late September and then transition to October because for some reason I want a billion and one things when it comes to buying stuff for myself and if nobody else is going to buy it, you know who's gonna buy it if I'm not gonna buy it you know so it's a lot and I am so surprised that I have all this stuff but before we get into this haul please do not forget to like comment and subscribe um I would start off with the stuff that I bought late last month but I just it's a lot so we're just gonna go ahead and get into the video and yeah all right so actually I'm going to start off with what I have on me or with me. Um, the first, one of the first things that I bought, this was actually like in August, I believe. Um, let me send up here. This here is um, one of the sweatshirts from Ariana Grande's merch. This is actually um, a sweatshirt from uh, the 10th anniversary celebration of her debut album yours truly and if you're not a fan a huge fan of Ariana Grande um, this shirt is with the lyrics of my favorite song off her debut album loving it so this I this song is so underrated with the album that album is underrated itself so I was just like I'm gonna get it and I'm why am I so exhausted already I don't know why but yeah um this is the sweatshirt i think i've been wearing this four times now um i bought it back in august but shipping didn't like start until like early october and then i got myself a new cell phone um this is the iphone 12. um i was planning to get a new cell phone for a really long time for the past two years now i've had an iphone 8 um, and that was kind of like a last minute thing because beforehand I had like this Android phone and it just stopped working on me all of a sudden. And at the time I was just like, I need a new phone, I need a new phone. And, um, I just could not afford, like, I think the 11 and the 12 was around at the time. I couldn't afford it at the time. So I was like, forget it. I'm going to just get a, um, a used iPhone 8. So I just stuck with that for a little bit. And then I was like, I need to upgrade. So this is the iPhone 12. Um. I was not look who's on my can y'all see that hold on <laughs> y'all probably can't see that oops yay look who's on my 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 wallpaper um I needed a new phone I was gonna get the 11 and then with my provider um, it was actually less than two hundred dollars to get the 12 so it was gonna be almost 300 if I got the 11 with my cell phone provider I was not gonna get the 13 14 or 15 because that is literally rent money and as much as I like to spend money on a lot of things an iPhone that's like worth rent money is definitely not it so um, those are the first two things that I have already here hopefully that angle looks a little bit better now we're gonna get into the clothes I have a plethora oh my god the anger just fell anyways I have like so many pieces of clothing and I don't even remember where I got everything I think some of this stuff we'll get into it okay so this is a cinema cinema roll sweatshirt I actually got this from Target this is cute it's comfy I think I've worn this like twice now but I'm really trying to be really careful because it's cute and pastel-y and a lot of my pastel clothes like when I first get them I try to be careful with them because I know one minute it's gonna look nice and then the next I'm gonna look down and there's a stain there I'm like what the heck where's the stain doing here so I try to be careful with that there and then this I think I got this from Rainbow I, I've been shopping so much within this past few weeks I don't even remember where everything came from this is from Rainbow. It's like a fuzzy, like cropped kind of 
jacket it sheds a lot but i mean it's rainbow so i'm it's not that i do expect it from rainbow but it's kind of unexpected it's a little cute and then i have this cropped can y'all see that yes y'all can i have like this cropped shirt i tried it on this i'm definitely gonna wear with some high-waisted jeans i don't know why i bought that around this time of the year because it's starting to get cold and kansas city weather is crazy one minute it's gonna be like like flaming hot outside the next is gonna be freezing hot it's currently like raining it was not raining but it was like drizzling earlier and it was like moist and i was like oh my god no so i have another shirt and then this is cropped but i'll be prepared for this summer see i'm a little weird when i shop one thing about me i'm like so weird when i shop for me it's like in the cold winter time like i will buy stuff for summer but it's unintentional i'm just like oh my god it's cute i could definitely wear this once that time approaches and then like spring summer i'm like oh my god i can wear this during the fall i could be prepared so i just buy clothes like kind of at the wrong time but it's a little bit more cheaper when you buy clothes that are not in season but this is a dress about this dress here i love the lace and i love the lace at the bottom too right here i actually wore this for my birthday dinner that i just had this past saturday um and y'all can see photos of that on insta um follow me at it's ty renee that is my birthday dress and then here is a sweatshirt cropped um sweatshirt with like a turtleneck to it look at that can y'all see that yes y'all can the light's a little eh, look at that the moon in the middle it's giving sailor moon i've never seen sailor moon a day in my life i just heard the theme song and the theme song is like so catchy <laughs> and then i have like this preppy um sweatshirt it's so preppy in here <laughs> i have like this preppy um sweatshirt it got like the buttons on there that's cute um, and then I have another one. This is giving Fran from the nanny. Oh my god. With like the fuzzy um, cuffs. Fuzzy at the bottom. And it's white. Peach. Not peach. Yeah, it's like white. It's like off-white. And then let me get these other stuff here. Oh, my arms hurt so bad. I, why am I like exhausted from like just pulling clothes off of each other and showing them to you that's why i need to exercise anyways i have another cropped shirt now when i first put this on i was like this when i first looked at it i was like this too small this ain't gonna fit me because you know my tit my titties are like no this is not gonna work but when i put it on i'm like oh okay this is manageable as long as i have like high-waisted shorts or like a high-waisted like jeans that'll definitely work See, my tits be like my biggest downfall when it comes to clothes because it's like, oh my god, it looks cute. Da 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 da. Like I used to be able to wear a medium. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. I used to be able to wear a medium, but like my tits be like my biggest downfall. And a lot of people are like, oh my god, I wish I had big titties. No, you don't. I promise you, you don't. And then here is, oh my god, why is everything falling off? And then here is this lace like sweater. Y'all probably cannot like, yeah. I gotta adjust it a little bit more whenever I get the chance to wear it. I think I have to like iron it to like kind of straighten it out so I won't look a little like crookily. And then here is a another dress. You guys, if you follow me on Instagram, then you've seen this dress before. Actually, I posted this on Twitter too. But I wore this dress when I went out to like this super nice Italian restaurant in my city. Beautiful, beautiful. This actually reminds me of the dress that Ariana wore um for the um 10th anniversary like um live performances she did for yours truly but yeah that is all the clothes that we have so far and now we are going to get into we're gonna get into books yes i have books so come along with me as you can see what books i bought i don't know why today my hair is like looking like extra red but i'm not complaining but that means i'm gonna have to watch the little mermaid again for the umpteenth time Literally ever since they put it on Disney Plus, the new one, I don't know how many times I watched it now. Can I be honest with y'all? This movie, that movie, I love The Little Mermaid. Like, Halle Bailey does such a great job, but I feel like it's more like phenomenal and whimsical when you watch it in theaters versus like at home. Some movies are like better to watch in theaters and then some movies are better to watch at home. 
this movie is definitely one of those movies to like watch in theaters i'm glad i went to see it twice because yeah that movie is just my everything speaking of the little mermaid i actually got a book i have another book but this is leading into regards of my talking of the little mermaid but this is little mermaid against the tide this is actually the prequel i believe this took place a year after um or before the first movie here so um i don't think ursula and eric I know for a fact Eric is not going to be in here, but I don't think Ursula is really too much in this. But just looking at the description, I know that the sisters are a little bit more involved compared to what they have been in like the main source material. Um, so I am definitely going to be reading this. This cover looks so good and like on the side and on the back, like it looks so good. And then there's Flounder. I love the new version of Flounder. People are so hateful. I don't understand why people hate the new Flounder. But um, this is the prequel book. And then I have another book which would lead into something that I've been getting into most recently. This is Final Fantasy XV, The Dawn of the Future. I just bought this because this past Saturday, Sunday, because I'd be staying up late at night playing games. I finished actually playing Final Fantasy 15 for the very first time and oh my god y'all I cried like I found out I was getting cheated on I don't know if I cried worse with this game or Final Fantasy 10 because I played Final Fantasy 10 for the first time earlier this year and I thought y'all was being dramatic I okay y'all know I already finished this so a review is coming on the way hopefully I want to actually get that review out the same day because the anniversary is coming up if I'm not mistaken it is the eighth anniversary coming up for that game I feel like it's the eighth yeah but I'm gonna reviews coming up soon I'll get in detail later but yes I have this book here I still need to play the other DLCs I need to watch the movie I need to watch the anime but I just bought that because impulsive spending habit maybe yes I don't know yes it was very impulsive okay I had to take like a mini break because the clothes and the books I made sure, I was just like let me just put up stuff along the way so it won't be so much of a dread once I'm fully done with this video and then I took a sip of my water and then I choked so we're back we're rolling next I got some um like off-brand kind of like uggs because i was not gonna spend damn near a hundred dollars for some uggs and then i have like a whole lot more on my wish list on amazon so i'm definitely gonna be buying some more and then i'm doing a christmas haul this year like i did last year um so it's like bows on the side and it's furry and fuzzy i only wore them one time but i'm trying to be careful so i don't crease them already and then oh my god i'm out of breath Y'all yeah, just saying that I'm out of breath from doing regular day-to-day -day whatever. And then I have these Bluetooth headphones. I like them. The volume's nice. But I don't like it that every time I turn up the volume all the way to the max, they be like, maximum volume. Ma'am, I know that. I don't need you trying to inter like trying to interrupt while I'm trying to get to the best part of the song. Because like for me, when I listen to music, I be listening. And then when the best part come, I turn it all the way up. But when I turn it all the way up to get to the best part, it be like, maximum volume. And I'm like... Now I missed the best part. Now I gotta rewind it. Anyways, whatever. Now we're gonna get into the like home and like beauty stuff that I got. So let's get there. Yeah, I promise y'all once this video comes to a conclusion, I'm going to sleep. I'm actually on vacation. Like I took a week off of work because I thought that Final Fantasy 15 was gonna be a long game for me to proceed. So I just wanted to take the week off to finish it. Y'all, I finished earlier than I expected. I can't believe I finished that game within two weeks and two days. And it went by so fast. And it breaks my heart. Will I replay that game again? Absolutely, for sure. I'm not going to talk about it because I have a whole review coming up. So keep your eye out on that. Make sure you turn on your bell notifications once that comes. Because that will be coming next month for sure. Anyways, on to the beauty stuff. I got me another makeup bag because my other one was getting all big and bulky and I didn't want to just keep shoving stuff in there so I got me a cinema roll 
makeup bag it's a little like empty on the inside because some of the old stuff that i have on the old makeup bag i put in there so this is what it looks like on the inside nothing crazy nothing major but it's taller so i have more space to put new stuff in now i got me some new makeup products and some of it i think one thing is just to restock everything else is just completely brand new let me go get it all right so this here is the rare beauty i can't believe i'm doing this i feel like a real influencer this is the rare beauty tinted moisturizer i bought this because in the summer i went to a festival with full face of makeup on and it damn near melted off and i've never had my makeup melted off like off my face before where it felt like it was dripping but the summer weather has been so bad this year everybody has been like in a hundred plus something degrees or so so this is a lifesaver i've been using this more since then i don't remember the last time i wore foundation but this a little bit more light it doesn't even feel like i have foundation on my face um but this definitely helps and um i still have my foundations but this is this is really supposed to be for the summertime but I can always restock. Anyways, this is a restock on the best primer in the whole wide world. I did not like it at first because I was like, this is too sticky. What am I supposed to do with this? But this helps my makeup stay on. And um, this is my second bottle. So, you know, when people, you know, they make things on TikTok trend, this is worth it. I promise you that. And then I had got some drugstore, um, what is this called? Golly, drugstore clear lip gloss because my lips are so dry. I'm always like, I need some lip gloss, I need some lip gloss, I need some lip gloss. But lip gloss does not really do the job when it comes to um, the oils and the moisturizing things that your lips need. So this is a glittery one and then this is a clear one. And this is like just from the hair beauty store like across the street from my house. And then I actually got Vaseline. I'm licking my lips, so maybe this is a sign I need to put this on my lips. This definitely helps my lips more than anything that I have ever used. I've used like lip therapy, um, like lip gloss, and some that just does not help. So definitely a four pack of these help. Maybe I should zoom in on that? No. Um, yeah, definitely a four pack of these. This is the first one, so I don't know why it came in tiny. I thought it was going to be like a big jar not complaining and then i got some lip stuff from rare beauty i actually bought this matte lip cream in the color kindness this is actually for the um halloween costume i'm doing this year because i was doing some extra research on the costume and the person that i'm going to be for halloween had like this cute makeup and like the outfit she wore so i was just looking up stuff the actual makeup she had used in her costume, so expensive or like just old and out of stock. I was not going to spend $40 on an uh, exact lip color. So I just found a dupe and this is the dupe. Put it on my lips. Looks perfect and it's creamy. It's nice matte. It doesn't dry up and doesn't flake, whatever. And then I got lip oils of Rare Beauty and these, oh my god. I these like when you put them on it may not look like nothing at first but once you let it sit for like two or three minutes the color comes in it's cute it perfect it lasts long I've accidentally fallen asleep with these on my lips before the color is still there you eat you drink it don't move it don't like smear love it perfect recommend 100% out of 10 and then when I went to Sephora um I went to Sephora for something else I'm about to show here I had gotten this eyelash mascara for a birthday gift because i get gifts like you know if you go on your birthday da 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 i was like i really don't need another mascara but i put it on y'all flawless and it's a mini i don't know what it's called i think it's called Ilya. can i Ilya. Ugh. let me zoom in oh god whatever anyways this is the Ilya mini eyelash i've been wearing this ever since i'm about to throw out my own one because my old one just really give out like dollar tree and i'm definitely gonna buy some more when this runs out and then i got the rare beauty highlighter because every time i try to get it in store it remains 
out of stock everybody wants it this is in the color of enlightened this is my first highlighter so hopefully um i'm doing this right because highlighter was like such a huge thing in 2016 and now that it's not but that's okay i am going to try to work and see what i'm going to do to work make it work and then i have house labs lip oil i had a friend that was wearing it and she let me borrow it i was like bro this is so good and i've only worn it one time i haven't worn my own but i, I was just like i need this i need this but that's all the beauty stuff that we have and then we're going to get into candles and perfume all right so so far i've only bought one thing of perfume i've only bought perfume one time this year all that perfume you guys saw in my christmas and birthday haul from last year i still have that but this perfume is the ariana grande cloud pink um i don't know really know how to describe the smell but it's not no way in shape or form it's like not strong like the other ones do i like it yes i love all versions of cloud so this is definitely like i'm not hating on this in no shape or form but this is the only perfume that i've bought this year and i need to get the original cloud because i currently have the 2.0 and then i have this one i completely ran out of the first cloud oh my god y'all the first time i got the first cloud i was in love that is the best perfume i've ever smelled in my entire life and then I have Bath and Body Works candles. Can I get them? Um, I used to be stocked up on candles. And then for like a long period of time, I just did not stock up on it because I was just like, eh, whatever. So this is um, pumpkin pecan waffles. Smells delightful. I, ooh, I think I'm about to light that up later on today. That smells nice. And then there's strawberry pound cake. You can't go wrong with strawberry pound cake. A lot of people don't like the candle of strawberry pound cake. They like the smell when it comes to like body care. It smells the same. I don't know what people are talking about. And then I have sprinkled birthday cake. This one I believe is an online exclusive. So I get it every time when it's available because it's online exclusive but then it like goes away. For like seasonal time not too sure and then this one is tis the season oh that smells very very apple cidery i'm sorry i haven't lit up candles in a long time yeah and then i have sugared lemon zest this is more this is more like if you want like i'm over here doing this like y'all can smell it ah uh, ty what is wrong with you um this is sugared lemon zest most of those are like sugary sweet but this one is more like you want a clean smell this is perfect for like the kitchen i don't have my own house because i still live at home but i would definitely have this smell after i deep clean my whole house like this is something you like saturday morning you know like when you get up and you like playing music and cleaning your house on saturday morning. this the one if you black you know perfect this mm. is that everything that is everything we bought y'all i thought i had so much more it feels like my pockets say it's much more i just looking at it it's not really my pockets my pockets say tie it's way much more than you need to be spending so already y'all so it is currently y'all cannot see that i don't know why i'm showing y'all that like i see that it is oh my god it is 12 42 at the moment here i thought it was gonna be like one o'clock I don't know filming for me it feels like when i film a video for you guys it kind of feels like an hour in a sense but um that is actually the conclusion of the birthday haul um that everything i bought for my 23rd birthday um i'm recording this on october 24th october 25th is my birthday so when y'all see this it's going to be my birthday i will be 23 years old um comment down below how old you are and you know like if you're older than me like What's some great things that you would like say in regards to someone who's turning 23? Um, now that I think about it, I'm about to be pushing my mid-20s and that's kind of scary to think about. But yeah, um, I am going to go relax for the day. Again, I am on um, my vacation, just a week off of work. Um, I'm just going to chill, watch some movies and just lay down and just scroll on TikTok and try to get some more content done out the way throughout the week. I've gotten so much done it is insane so yeah but thank you guys so much for tuning in today um thank you guys for being a part of my life you guys have made 
my 22nd birthday amazing and you guys are going to make my 23rd birthday amazing and hopefully there's more birthdays to come where you guys make it more and more amazing but yeah um don't forget to like comment subscribe and share follow me on all social platforms and i will see you guys in the next video take care now bye